Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and happy Wish Wednesday. Alright, if you're new here, my name is Claire. I'm the mother of two little boys and this channel is all about mom stuff, lady stuff, and life stuff. And every single Wednesday, I do a review of something I got on Wish.com, everyone's favorite cheap Chinese website. So today I have um, a beauty product for you. I do all sorts of things, kitchen items, home items, uh, kids items. Definitely check out all of my Wish adventures. I will leave a link to the playlist down below. But today I'm excited. I got in the mail uh, this little like finger guards for doing nail polish and um, it was totally free. And it came with these little strips to do a French manicure. So. I'm gonna give these a try today. So, if you've ever got anything on Wish.com, if it's free, it means you only pay shipping, and the shipping on this was like one or two dollars, so, you know, pretty cheap. Um, and I didn't know that it was gonna come with these. These are like little strips. I don't know, you can't see them. You'll see when I use them, but you put them on your nails to do a French manicure. Uh, so I'll be doing a little twist on the French classic nail. I'm gonna be doing a pink French manicure. But basically, like, you put your you put your nails in there. I don't know. There's like a lot of different ones and sizes. They seem to have like numbers on them. All right, I'm gonna reposition the camera down to my fingers and uh, we'll see how it goes. I don't know. You can't see it very well, but there's a little like teeny tiny number right there. There we go. This is number three. So I'm gonna put them in order. That's a five. Okay. Here they are all laid out. As you can see, there are a ton of them. So if you have several fingers that are like the same-ish size, you aren't gonna be like totally screwed and not have enough pieces. So we're gonna start, I'm gonna start with my pinky. Um, and yeah, you just slide. Ooh, yep, the ones are too small for me. That's not happening. Okay, there we go. Okay, so I have them all on my hands right now. So beautiful. And I will say that my thumb is currently wearing a size 8, and my pinky is wearing a size 2. So it does go down one more size than my smallest, and it goes up to a 10. So these would fit everybody. Like, there's, an, I don't think there's any right these wouldn't fit. I mean, you can see my hands are, like, pretty chunky, so... <laughs> They seem like they're gonna work. Uh, next, I'm going to take the little stickers and I'm gonna put them for where like the French manicure would be. I feel so fancy. So I have the stickers on all of my nails and as I said, I'm going to do pink tips because I don't know, I think it's just like a little more fun and a little summery and I'm not really your traditional kind of person. So this is the pink I'm going to use. It's by Sinful Colors. This is not from Wish.com. This is just some nail polish I have laying around, but I thought it would be cute. All right, so, you know, it is really handy having that little guard here. I mean, I've done French manicures on myself before and I they tend to get a little bit messy just because you have to be like real good up on the sides, you know? Alright you guys, these are just drying now and I do want to note that these are really handy for reminding you not to touch stuff because especially if you're a mother like me, my problem is I paint my nails and then like 10 minutes later like somebody needs me and I like forget about it and then I mess them all up and there's scratches and fingerprints and chips in them already so this is kind of a way where like I can't like accidentally like grab something and like mess them up so I mean that's kind of nice so worth noting I suppose. Okay, now I've waited and my tips are nice and dry, so I'm gonna peel them off and see if the strips worked well. Are you ready to rumble? Okay, alright. Oh, didn't mean to like flip you off there a little bit. 
Um, that's the first finger I've peeled and uh, it's a pretty clean line. So I'm gonna go ahead and peel the rest off and see what they look like. You know what, in retrospect, I probably shouldn't have used the same color for the tips of my nails as the uh, finger guards, but it does have a nice clean line on them, so I'm gonna go ahead and just put a quick top coat. I'm gonna leave these on for the top coat, cause hey, you might as well, you're not gonna get it all over your finger that way. So I'm just gonna throw that on. All right, so I just went over it really quickly with this clear coat, and honestly, I'm ready to get these things off because they're kind of hurting a little bit. So if you're doing something like, oh, real complicated on there, and you need to leave them on for a while, it might not be the most comfortable. So that is definitely something worth noting. Ah, okay. You know what? Those look really cute, you guys. Here. I feel like I feel like I need something white behind them. Note this book, Wild Like Me by Louise Pentland, my favorite YouTuber of all time. Okay, so you can really see that these look totally darling. And you know what? Could I have done this without those like finger things? I mean, probably. I will say it did make it a lot easier. I don't have to go through with like a Q-tip and like fix up any touch-ups, which is really nice. I think these are really cute. Um, as soon as I stop filming, I'll do the other hand because it's gonna look a little bit ridiculous if I don't. But I think this was a wish win. I mean, I understand if like you think it's a waste of time. If you like have like the steadiest hands and you don't need that, then like girl, more power to you. But I think it's useful. I'll keep them around and every now and then when I'm feeling in the mood to be a little bit French, I will use them. So wish win guys. All right, there we go. Another wish Wednesday and I think this one was pretty successful. Uh, if you thought so too, give me a like and definitely hit that subscribe button because I do one of these every single Wednesday and I would love to have you. And again, I will leave a link down below of all of my wish Wednesday adventures if you're into that. So definitely check it out and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye.